How do you feel about sharks? Do they fascinate you or terrify you? Would you like to see one, or would you prefer never to set eyes on one of them? Hello, everyone. I'm Kathleen Pally. Welcome to Journey with Story. Today's episode is a short and snappy poem. Excuse the pun. All about this fascinating creature called a shark. Let's take a journey with the shark by Lord Alfred Douglas. A treacherous monster is the shark. He never makes the least remark, and when he sees you on the sand, he doesn't seem to want to land. He watches you take off your clothes, and not the least excitement shows. His eyes do not grow bright or roll. He has astonishing self-control. He waits till you are quite undressed, and seems to take no interest. And when towards the sea you leap, he looks as if he were asleep. But when you once get in his range, his whole demeanour seems to change. He throws his body right about, and his true character comes out. It's no use crying or appealing; he seems to lose all decent feeling. After this warning, you will wish to keep clear of this treacherous fish. His back is black, his stomach white. He has a very dangerous bite. Well, I don't know about you, but after hearing this poem, I don't think I want to meet a real live shark while I'm out swimming in the ocean. Still, it is fun to feel a little frisson of fear as we listen to this poem, all safe and snug on dry land. Cheerio, then. Join me next time for Journey with Story.